Hello friend, welcome back to Toyota Maintenance YouTube channel. And here is another Toyota tech video. The vehicle is 2005 Sequoia and it will be about outside door handle. And yes, I mean the handle which is on the door outside and this is the passenger side and if you look on this mechanism this one looks and works really good here it's one more time in the detail when i'm opening it right everything nicely works when i bought this sequoia i immediately saw that something is wrong here right let me show you the de detail when i pull on that whole handle that entire trim it's peeling off I hope you can see it right so this is what's happening I know that's being held by two bolts from inside unfortunately this includes removing the door panel that's why I didn't take care of it immediately but now the door panel it's off as you will see right here right and we can finally take care of this problem we'll go ahead and peel off this moisture barrier from this area the handle is right behind there and let's go if we can see those bolts and i did so and i can actually see that gold color that bolt which is holding the front of it right you can see there too right there it's a probably 10 millimeter but now how can we see the other one so i put the light in the door to make it more visible for us and longer and longer i work on this vehicle i found more and more very poor work performed in the past so if you look here supposed to be rubber plugs right this one is missing and that immediately gives you a hint, right, that oh, that's a plug, that's a location, the hole was made there for installing that bolt. And if I look inside, of course, the bolt is completely missing. It's not just loose that it got lost, but it's missing because of that plug not being here and also missing, right? It, I'm afraid that somebody was working on it and just didn't bother put it back. But you know what? I always, when I work on the, these doors, right, I always find a lot of things inside there. Of course, when you put your hand there, you better be careful, there might be broken glass or something, right? But let's see. If I'm lucky, maybe that bolt will be there. So far, a lot of debris. And what is this? Huh? Look at it. If I'm correct, this is that matching gold color bolt. I'm not saying that the access to that mounting hole, right, for installing this little bolt it's easy it's not ideal right it's not the best one but they made here that service opening the toyota and if i'm a little bit lucky i hope i will be able to install it not on the first time interesting thing happened why i have suddenly two bolts well, when I was trying to put it there, my wobble 10 millimeter is really worn and it's not holding. So I lost the bolt and it fell down. But it didn't fall all the way down. It stayed on this protective bar. Well, when I looked there, there was not one. There were already two of them sitting there. That's pretty funny. So try number two will happen right now. If your wobble gets really bad and loose, you can always use a little bit of electrical tape, right? One or two layers. 
which makes it still moving but it's holding a uh, angle better right so let's try if it will work this time it's not straight right otherwise I will use just ex extension it's a little bit off this service opening it's a little bit below that thread but I have a hope I can catch that thread which happened tight it that's a good question how much probably not too much and I'm done with this repair this is fantastic and for those non-believers right who think oh I just pretend that I fixed it let's put this shield back let's close the door nothing should be in the way anywhere and let's see did it improve or not oh, la la the whole trim right is perfectly holding let me zoom on it this was peeling off before right that bolt which is basically right here and the second one right here was missing completely I didn't know that and the problem is fixed and that means I got at least a little bit lucky today right at least be because when I removed the door panel today there was an absolute nightmare here all that wiring was cut in the pieces sliced redirected for some kind of aftermarket stereo amplifier or something like this some piece of junk right the speaker was hanging out attached by the drywall screws unbelievable you can see it in the different video which is about that removal of that door panel and of course i will not put a door panel back without fully lubricating that window actuator right now i know from where was the other bolt the window it's attached only here the other bolt which is here is missing so that was the second what somebody did to this sequoia in past i have no idea but it's terrible The good news is that she's getting fixed up, right? So thank you for watching and be subscribed because I have way more this stuff coming your way soon. See you later, my friend.